Interesting. This is great. This is amazing information. Um, so then I guess the next thing for me is just like try to network and find people that are, are starting to invest in some deals and try to kind of go from there. Right. Yeah. I mean, you have to meet, uh, there's a couple of people you need to meet. You need to meet other general partners who have multifamily ownership already. That's number one. Yeah. Um, number two, I would say you would start building sort of a limited partner database. Um, if you wanted to buy larger deals, right. Where you didn't have all the money. Um, so that can be, I always like people within your network of people who have money already and they know you and you're the only person doing multifamily is a good spot. Um, and then, um, third is probably deal flow. So you need to get in front of listing brokers. You need to get, um, on their list. Um, right now there are not a lot of deals on the market, so I would probably just pull old deals and start underwriting those and start getting familiar with, and then, I mean, like I would probably look at every deal that's been listed in the last six months and yeah. figure out sort of what the rents are, you know, what the occupancy was, what price did it sell for? I mean, in DFW, it's probably like a five to 10% discount right now. If a deal comes to market compared to three months ago or something like that on a stabilized right. deal that you're looking for. So you can probably take a little bit of a discount and then um, sort of underwrite it from there. 